technician worked on this mini split air conditioner. He cleaned it. After he cleaned it, the unit was not working properly. Now this unit has arrived to us for repair. This unit works for some time and then stops. Let me start by passing electricity through this unit, and then find out what problem it is making. The unit is not running, so in this condition, the refrigerant pressure of the unit is 240 psi, which is almost fine. I will now pass electricity through the unit and find out why it is causing the problem. The unit has started to work, as I have passed electricity through it. The compressor has also started to work. The needle on the manifold gauge has started to go down. The needle has reached 100 psi of pressure. I will check what error it displays on the indoor unit. The unit started working for some time and has stopped working. The operation light is working on the indoor unit, which is red, but it does not show an error on the timer light. If your air conditioner is having problems, then start the unit, and then leave it in working condition, because it will keep turning on and off. Depending on the brand, it can turn on and off for half an hour or an hour. When the unit self-diagnosed the problem, an error appears on the display. This unit also self-diagnosed the problem. According to it, the blinking error code will be displayed on the display of the indoor unit or the LED of the outdoor circuit board. It would be much easier for me if it showed the error code on the indoor display. It has been 5 to 4 hours since this air conditioner is working. But no error code has been displayed on the unit. It is just turning on and off. It consumes 1.5 to 2 amperes and then stops. I talked to the technician who brought this unit to me. Then, I talked to the owner of this mini split air conditioner. The owner sent me a video that he told me he gave to another technician. The owner saw the light blink when the unit was installed in their house. Let me show you that video with you guys as well. Your information will increase as we have received the error code video. The owner told me he had left the air conditioner unit running all night. Then, this error code showed on the display. And they accidentally left it overnight. When I studied this error code, this light blinking was a combination of 5 and 2 blinks. Now I understand the meaning of this problem, so let me show you what it means. The technicians did not clean the indoor unit, they just cleaned the outdoor unit. After cleaning the outdoor, the problem in this unit started to show. The 5 and 2 blinking pattern means that indoor or outdoor unit sensors are faulty. I am opening the front cover of the outdoor unit to check which sensor is defective in the unit. The cover has been opened now. This is the discharge pipe coil of the unit. This orange colored wire thermistor is installed on it. This is the wrong thermistor installed on its discharge line. The thermistors are not installed properly in their place. I will open this side cover as well. I think mistakes are made in the thermistor's location. This pink sensor is installed downward, which is wrong. The pink thermistor is for the discharge pipe. The orange thermistor is for the condenser. They are installed at the wrong locations. Sharp air conditioners have two types of models. One model has four thermistors. The other model has five thermistors in it. In this model, five thermistors are installed. If these thermistors are not installed properly in their respective pipes, then this air conditioner will cause problems. While putting these thermistors back, the technician who cleaned this air conditioner attached them to the wrong locations. This yellow thermistor will be attached to this pipe. This thermistor is attached after the expansion valve to measure the temperature of the colder refrigerant. Now, I have attached the thermistors in their respective location. Let me show you as well where I have attached these thermistors now. The black thermistor is for the return pipe or the suction pipe. This yellow thermistor is a special one. In those models with four thermistors, this yellow thermistor is not present there, which means this pipe will be vacant. When the expansion valve expands the refrigerant, it means cooling it down, it measures that temperature. The orange thermistor is installed with the condenser pipe before the expansion valve. This green colored wire is a thermistor for measuring the outdoor temperature, attached to the condenser with a plastic clip. The pink color thermistor is attached to the compressor discharge pipe. Now I will screw the cover I removed, and then let's check how it works. I have started the unit again after attaching the covers. It has started to work again. However, there is another issue, it consumes 4.7 amperes. What is the reason? Let me tell you that. As you can see, we went from morning to evening. The discharge pipe of the air conditioner is freezing with ice, which is not a good thing. This means the problem could be in the quantity of the refrigerant in this air conditioner. The pressure of the suction pipe is almost 75 psi. The compressor has speed up a little. It is consuming 7.5 amperes now. But the ice problem is still the same. Ice is not melting from the discharge pipe. It would have melted after speeding up. The pressure on the gauge would have decreased further. The pressure is still the same on 70 psi. I will charge the new refrigerant in this unit by replacing it with the old one. And it will be fixed. 
I am tired now, and I run on coffee. So buy it for me on Patreon. Click the link on the screen to visit. Click on the left or right thumbnail to watch our next videos. And subscribe. Thank you.